Welcome to Vlogmas Day 7. I'm going in. Okay. 
I want to try this because I want to try this gin. Back home, um, so left the grocery at Salunga. That's one of the groceries that we like to shop at. I just picked up a few things. We didn't really plan to pick up anything, but we saw some things, so we picked it up. If you saw my vlog last year, I mentioned that Panotone and Pandoro are popular cakes. The Italians have around Christmas time, so as Christmas is coming, the grocery stores are always filled with variations of it and it's basically like i guess fruit cake um it's like a stored version so the bakeries do it the groceries do it a lot of different brands do it and we weren't planning to buy one this year but we saw that this brand had a collab with baileys so we were like why not to we'll try it so um i got the pandoro so the pandoro is like a regular i like to call it sponge cake and the um, panettone is more like the fruitcake version. So it has all the dried fruits and those kind of things in it. But I don't really like like raisins and those kind of things in cake. So mm, not my vibe. So I got the pandoro. I cannot wait to try this. Then for Dindin's bar, it's trying to make a little fancy mac and cheese. Try it. Excuse me. Bar is going to make a fancy mac and cheese. I so know, he got. No, not mac and cheese. Pasta. I'm going to leave in the spot just for that. Feel free. <laughs> so, anyway, <laughs> Bar is going to make what? Gorgonzola pasta. Gorgonzola pasta. Mac and cheese. So, he got some Gorgonzola uh, cheese. And then, what do you want to do? They say mac and cheese too. Uh, that's not how we're going to sprinkle some on top of maybe, but we do have parmesan. And some toma al pepperoncino. 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 Just to have, I guess, a kind of cheese. And we got some white rum because we, we, we don't have any white soak. We don't. We don't have the white so we don't have the punching. So we got this white wine. <laughs> we got this white rum. Wow. Too long. Clearly. <laughs> we got this white rum. Um, because we plan to make some puncha creme, but we are banking on finding evaporated milk. So um, we went to the international stores close to us, but we didn't see any evaporated milk. So Bar is going to go on the hunt for ev evaporated milk in Porto Valencia, which is the African kind of community. So, yeah, he's going to look for that there. And I found this in one of the international stores earlier this year. And it looks like sorrel to me. So... I try to make some sorrel this year, so the rum, we'll probably spike it with some rum as well. But this is Bissap, um, and they say hibiscus sabadarifa. So, this looks like hibiscus, right? I mean, this looks like sorrel, right? So, I'm gonna make some sorrel. So, Bar went to find the ingredients. And the main thing that I mentioned that we were looking for was the evaporated book and we weren't seeing it in the international stores around by us. But um, when he was like feeling it, it has a difference and they describe evaporated milk as unsweetened condensed milk, which is weird. Anyway, so it has this carnation. It says condensed milk, but it sounds like evaporated milk and then it has the well the nestle as well um condensed milk and it says sweetened condensed milk and this consistency is the regular consistency of condensed milk as i or we know it so we are just hoping when we once we open this <laughs> it would be um evaporated milk and the thing is it has a cup of tea 
And I, if I remember correctly, the other one, the yellow box, the butterfly, has like a um a T on it or something. And this one has like, well, it has a T as well. <laughs> but it has um a cake on it too. So anyway, once it open, we shall see. But Barry is going to be the chef here today. So y'all will just watch him create. Punch a cram and okay, let me show you. So we have the ingredients here: eggs, we have cinnamon, nutmeg, um, evaporated milk, condensed milk. Of course, we have the Angostura brought from Trinidad. We, do, we were not paying 16 euro for Angostura, uh, <laughs> lime, the rum. And we're going to try to make, well, Barry is going to try to make the pumpkin punch of him. So we have some pumpkin here for him to make. So he's going to take over now. I don't think he's going to be talking, but y'all can watch him make it. Next up on the agenda, <coughs> agenda. <laughs> next up on the agenda is to make the sorrel, but I'll do that another day. I'm kind of very tired. But cheers! And I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe. We got into a thousand before the end of the year. And I'll see you guys tomorrow.